You know, Jim, as we all try to stay at home and follow these uh, stay at home orders, a lot of people are still trying to figure out how to continue their crafts or their talents and find ways to connect with others. As Dylan Thomas found out, he found a artist who is using her talents and her time at home to connect with some of the youngest Coloradans. Uh, my name is Miss Jules, and this is Arts Cool. Twice a week. I have Claire. Jules Elders is offering her craft to children for free. So far, it has been so much fun. During the COVID-19 outbreak, the artist uses drawing, coloring, and more to not only expose children to art, but to also educate them. Every class has a science component. Dozens of kids, mostly in Colorado, join the virtual meeting. Friday's was all about anglerfish. I decided to join in on the lesson to see what this was all about. Art can transcend boundaries and distances. They really need an outlet right now where they can stay connected with their peers. Much like in class, the students love to show off not only what they've learned, but also created. It's not finished, but how well is it, huh? I love it. You did absolutely fantastic. Jewel says through this free service, she hopes children will develop a passion for the arts and knowledge of science in a virtual social setting. Sometimes they are shy at first, but then through art, because of art, they come out of their shell and they start, you know, turning off their videos and they start joining the class. Art is a very therapeutic, relaxing activity. Right now, with all of this stress and chaos going on, it just really creates an, a beautiful atmosphere for the kids. Most kids did way better than I did, but hey, I was multitasking. For more information on how you can get your kids involved, visit cbsdenver.com. I'm Dylan Thomas, covering Colorado First.